it's Remy and welcome back to my channel where K-pop and gaming meet and welcome back to another episode of Love Ties. For today's episode, I thought it'd be fun to play with Lance. I feel like we've been playing with Leilani from Leilani's perspective most of this um, game. So I wanted to play with Lance for a little bit. And as you guys have seen, the families and love ties have done like a little time jump. So we're now four years into the future. Lance has graduated university, he's now in his career, he is a level 8 professor, so yeah, he's doing pretty good for himself. Um, he lives in an apartment in Evergreen Harbor, you know, doing his little thing, got his one bedroom going on, his office is in there, um, a bunch of cute stuff. But for today's episode, I thought it'd be really fun, since Lance is single, I thought it'd be really fun to like have him go on a couple of dates, see how life is for Lance, and you know, he's single, ready to mingle, maybe we'll find somebody for him to go on a date with, um, have him hang out with his family, stuff like that. So I haven't played around with the send a, um, oh this is the meet and mingle app. I have the send a dating app as well somewhere. Let me see where it is. Cause it said it was installed. Maybe I'm mistaken. But I'm gonna use the meet and mingle dating app. Um, specify person profile information. We haven't done anything with Lance's. So let's specify relationship goals. I think, um, I think Lance would be, a, he's more of a relationship type of guy, but since he hasn't dated in a while, um, I'm going to say that he's just looking for a good time. Um, his specific turn ons and turn offs. Um, uh, let's work on his um, personality turn-ons. It says, What about other Sims vibes makes you want to develop a connection with them? Pick no more than three. So, I feel like he would want somebody who is along the lines of him. Do they have one? Yep, nerdy. He would want somebody who is... Maybe on the smarter side, because he's also very smart. And I'm going to say active, because he also likes to be active as well. Um, I feel like his turnoffs would be bad vibes, or bad bay vibes. <laughs> um, do they have any, like, rude? don't have any that are like rude okay so bad bay vibes will be the one that he doesn't like and specify style turn-ons i don't think he would be that like specific about anything um and then so we're gonna have him check out the profiles on here Let's see who we have. Um, oh, not Agatha and Agnes Crumblebottom. Um, okay. Um, Alice is cute. Let's keep scrolling and see who's on here. Um, Julia, oh, we can't date Julia because Julia is Leilani's friend. Kayla Fleming is, Kayla's cute. Um, Leaning more towards Alice though. I gotta wait for these to load up a little bit. Um, he's friends with Summer Holidays, so that'd be interesting. I think we're gonna go on a date with Alice though. Alice seems like a fun time. Let's read her profile. Name, Alice Martin, young adult, education, 
Arthur did not specify career. Arthur did not specify um, personality, music lover, bookworm, creative, dislike. She didn't specify. She doesn't have children. I have never been in a long-term relationship. She likes funny, great cook, bad bay vibes, um, which is something that he does not like. Blonde hair, brown eyes, red hair, turned off, adventurous, and artist. She doesn't like people with freckles or body hair. I say we go for it just to see what it's like and see, oh, it's 7 a.m. Are we gonna go on a date at 7 a.m.? Maybe like a little coffee date. All right, we are at the um, cafe and Alice is here. So let's go ahead and say like a little hi or whatever. He's gonna greet her, chat with Alice, cool, cool. She's so pretty, I love her hair and her outfit. So let's find out about her. Um, let's do a little flirting, I guess. Um, ask if single, do a little friendly action. Um, ask about hobbies, I guess. Gaming strategy, see if she likes gaming. There might be something hidden that she likes. I don't think she likes it. Ooh, that might be a problem. She's like, eh, I don't I don't really mess with gaming like that. And why is this guy trying to get in the middle of our like conversation he's like yeah I like gaming can you what are you doing do you know him why why did she bring an extra person on the date just to make sure Lance wasn't crazy or something cuz he keeps talking to her or he keeps talking to Lance like what is this conversation this is already turning out to be not that great because this guy, she's not vibing with him and this guy keeps wanting to talk to Lance. Um, let's come over here away from this guy. Let's sit here and chat. Why is everybody pregnant? I just saw like three different Sims that were like freaking pregnant. What the heck is going on? Why are you fall? What are you doing? What what is what is this guy doing? Let's sit here together. Like, can we have some privacy, please? What is what are you doing? He's like, yeah, let's all hang out together. No, guy, we don't know you. Bye. Thank you for leaving us alone. Maybe now we can have like a private conversation. Um, let's offer relaxation tips. Let's get like the conversation going. Maybe she'll yeah. think that Lance is funny. <laughs> oh, she thinks he's hilarious. Okay. Um, share brilliant ideas. But then friendly interests, discuss interests. They're kind of just like staring at each other. It's kind of weird. Um, hobbies. And those about video games. He looks, look at his face. He's like, this is so awkward. I don't know about this. Okay, she's definitely not interested in video games. She's like, I don't care. 
so this is kind of like a this is kind of like a hit or miss um discuss favorite arthurs maybe she likes oh she okay what was that she had a a circle where his face crossed out i don't know if this date is going well or not um friendly Small talk. Ask about turn offs. Her turn ons are funny parent material animal fan. Her turn offs are sensitive and generous. That's oh. She likes the color gray. Um, the turn offs sensitive and generous. You don't like. Generosity? That's a little... That's a little weird. I don't think... I think Lance is a very generous person. Look, there's another pregnant lady. Okay, sorry. My attention span is so bad. Um, I don't think that... Le not Lay. I don't think that Alex is a good fit for Lance, personally. Um, maybe she could be a friend. But she's a little, they don't have very much in common, I feel like. So I think what Lance is probably going to end up doing is he's just going to, you know, maybe he'll dip. Maybe he'll dip out on this, on this date. I know it's not like the best thing to do, but um, I don't think he's feeling the vibes. Um, maybe he'll meet up with Keith and, or maybe instead we'll go, we'll go visit his sister and his niece, his niece and nephew that he has. Cause that date was, the date was not good. And I feel like he was just wasting his time. All right. Currently Lance is at his sister and brother-in-law's house. He's hanging out with the fam, holding his niece who is, ooh. She is, she's having a hard time. Um, I think he's just gonna, I think that, um, what's his name? What is this at? Stefan's name, Stefan is just having a hard time. So he came to like hang out with his brother-in-law. He's dealing with both the kids, which I don't actually know where Jet is. Um, so we're gonna have to find, figure out where Jet is. Cause you know, babies will be, babies and toddlers will be in like the most random places ever um just gonna help him clean her up the dogs are a mess all that crazy stuff also i'm gonna locate jet hopefully he's not where is he locking camera oh oh god we gotta help him with jet too jet's just sitting here um, check this toddler while he's checking on Heidi. Because the family is just struggling. And he's just hanging out. He's dirty. Both of them are dirty. It's crazy. There you go. Might need to change his diaper too. No, he's good. Nah, he might need his diaper changed too. Um... But I feel like being around his niece and nephew really has made him like want a family even more than he already did. Um, so I think that he would come in, talk to his brother-in-law and like get his opinions on what he should do as far as like dating getting like dating advice because you know he's a married man and maybe he could like maybe he could like give him some advice on life and stuff because Lance really looks up to Stefan and um Kristen's relationship he, he feels like they're like such a perfect couple for each other and he kind of wants that for his life too so I feel like he would ask him questions like what did you do to get to where you are in your relationship how was the dating scene 
stuff like that because I just went on a date and it was terrible. So yeah, there you go. He's asking questions. He's like, what did you guys do? How did you find, how did you guys know that she was the one? Um, he finds out he's hot headed. <clears throat> so I guess Stefan's like, I was really hot headed and I'm still am kind of a hot headed person. And she just like mellowed me out. Um, she was, I just, I knew she was the one because of how we are with each other. Like, I just feel like I can be myself and she just makes me very happy. Maybe do some small talk, ask about his day. Oh, look who came home, Kristen, big sis. He's definitely, I feel like he would definitely get some older sister advice. What the heck? I feel like he would definitely get advice from his older sister on like how to go about doing stuff. Um, she was the one who like suggested that he goes on some dates, see um, what's out there. So maybe she'll have some advice for him. He's just like asking questions. Like, what should I do? Like, don't give up. Go on some more dates. Um, new family dynamic. It looks like Lance and Kristen just adore spending time with each other. Such comfortable camaraderie among family members is a blessing. I feel like their family dynamic would be close because they're kind of like best friends, but they're not exactly best friends. So yes, they would definitely be close. Um, but yeah, I feel like Kristen would just be like, yeah, you should definitely just stay you continue to be out there you're you're such an introvert but i feel like you would definitely find somebody that you you click with so don't give up keep looking just like don't give up keep looking um and get back out there
like Lance. This is how Lance's life has been for... I say he hasn't been like this the whole four years, but I think recently he's just been like really feeling it, you know, seeing his sister have two kids and being loved and being happy has made him really look back on his life and think, dang, I have, I have a great career. I'm financially stable but I don't have anybody to share it with. And as you guys can see, he went on several dates and they were failures. So, I don't know. Lance is, he's, career-wise, he's pretty happy, but his love life sucks. So, I think it's time to check out what Leilani has been up to. All right, you guys, we have met up with Leilani, and if you guys saw my previous video, Leilani has an art studio now. She, you know, she's also doing well in her career. She is a level seven master of the real. Um, she has her own art studio, so she's thriving. She's killing it. Um, she's living in Windenburg now, but her art studio is in, um, <laughs> San Sequoia and she's just she's enjoying herself she's currently painting something right now um she also hasn't been doing a lot of dating she's been more so you know she's been more so getting herself together focusing on herself and just being very happy so let's see what kind of painting she's getting into Okay, that's cute. Let's put that in the inventory and we can put that on the wall to be sold. I have not opened up her art studio yet because I feel like I wanted more paintings for her to have. Um, but there's just a couple of them. I didn't show them all in the, um, the art studio build because I wanted it to be like a surprise but it is very much so um a representation of Leilani um if you look around um the color from the colors to the art itself it's definitely Leilani you know she loves like pastels or vibrant colors so if you look around from the walls, they're like purple and blue. They're not all one color, they're multiple colors. Even the building is like a teal, like industrial type feel. And this art space, I um, I put it for more of her, her black heritage. Cause if you guys don't already know, Leilani is black and Samoan. Um, from Sulani. So this is um, just a little bit of her black heritage. I, I'd like to think of this as like her mom, her dad's side of the family. Um, maybe like some aunts, a cousin, maybe that's Leilani, that's her aunt, maybe that's her brother and someone else, I don't know. But I just thought the um, the music and the, all the pictures and stuff went well together and then there's also this which is at the very front of the art gallery this is a little bit of her Samoan heritage in here I wanted to add some more stuff but I couldn't find any but I think I'll go and like look on online and find some stuff to add to this spot so this stuff in here isn't actually for sale it's just more so for people to like come and look around and check out but the actual stuff she's painted will be for sale and she's doing like a cute little mural just to have for people to look at and to check out and stuff like that and this little space over here is gonna be like a little chill out spot for her and 
her employees to come in i'm gonna there's a mini fridge in here i'm gonna add a little bit more stuff in here just a couch um places for her and her um employees to come and like do art and stuff like that so that's that's what her art gallery looks like i think it'd be really fun since leilani is kind of her social need is kind of low i think it'd be really fun for her to meet up with her besties you know her besties um spencer and at ah, what is her annie so annie and spencer let's go out to like a club or something just for the the fun of it see what goes on out in the world maybe in an arcade i think i put the arcade down actually um arcade that i have on here yep it is high scores arcade and this is from d sims if you guys don't know who d sims is i absolutely love her content she's a simmer on youtube and i think you guys should check her out she does a lot of let's plays and a lot of like really fun content and she customized this arcade so yeah i'll leave the link to this um build in the description box in the description box below if you guys want to check it out so we are here we're at the high scores arcade um i really just wanted to see how it works i've never actually been in here i just placed it down um i just want to see what it's like so they can like come and have fun and chill out i think i'm gonna actually change her outfit because since I um, pushed them along like four years in, in the future, I went ahead and like changed their outfits to um, match what I feel like their style, how her style would have like evolved a little in the future. So a lot of her outfits are still like very vibrant and stuff, but she has a couple of them that are like a little bit more mature and stuff like that so she's gonna pay what is this called ski ball she's gonna pay a little ski ball and then i'm gonna have her come over here maybe like order a drink with her friends um order a drink for the group and we're gonna order let's order a mimosa Mimosa sounds good. She is losing so bad. But I don't even blame you. Ski ball is kind of hard. But oh, okay. One more for good luck. Ah. Alright. So let's go over and. Leilani beat Leilani beat level one. She got a reward, like any children's toy. What? She got some reward, like any children's toy. Okay, whatever. So she's ordering some mimosas for everybody. You hey guys, this build is amazing. Look at it. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. I have flu Moochie Peachy. I think it'd be really fun if um Annie and Melanie just like chatted about like their dating lives and stuff like that. See if she's dating anybody. Cause Leilani's just she's, right now she is, you know, just living her best life. Uh-huh. I feel like um, I feel like Annie would be asking her like a bunch of questions like Hey, how's your gallery going? Did you get all your pictures up? And she'd be like, oh yeah, it's coming along. And we're almost done. Like, how's your, how's your love life going? What's going on, girl? Where's she going? Why are you going outside? Where are you going? She's talking to some random girl. Leilani has always been like such an outgoing, like social butterfly. Oh. 
but I guess they wanted to come over here. It's open. Yeah. 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 It's like, hey. Um, but they definitely would be like talking about how their day is gone. Like, Alice is still pursuing her career in acting. Um, she definitely would be asking her, like, girls, when's the last time you on a date? She's like, oh, I, know, I don't have time for that. I am chilling. I have She's too much slave. going on to be worrying about dating. Uh -huh. And Amy would definitely Rosa. be asking questions like, uh -huh. Uh -huh. but aren't you like lonely or anything like that? You know, you gotta have a little fun in your life. Even if you're not trying to like settle down. She's like, I could. And then I think that Leilani would be asking her the same questions like what about you what kind of romantic interest are you into like what have you been getting to miss hollywood well she's like oh you know leilani has learned annie's romantic orientation she's like i'm still exploring trying to figure stuff out you know like i can understand that i get that but I definitely uh -huh. think that it'd be really fun <laughs> cool. to have like a oh, dag dag. Um, oh, gallery oh, opening. Maybe not at the gallery, but like a, a little party huh. for Leilani. Because if you know Leilani, she loves to have a little party and <laughs> a little get together. So I think it'd be really fun Shady if we like planned that. I think that oh, Amy would be the one to plan it. I think that'd be really fun for her. She'd be like, oh yeah, let me introduce you to like some of my celebrity friends. It'd be really fun. And then let be like, okay, okay. I'll, I'll, let's see what you got going on. I'm down. So yeah. Um, just meet me at my at, at this location on Friday and we'll get it popping. She's like, okay, I'll see you then, girl. I'll see you then, girl.